how to add mega menu in shopify store hi guys welcome back to another video and in today's video i'm going to be showing you how you can add a mega menu in your shopify store so having said that let's just jump into it so if we come over here we look at our store right we come over here as you can see we have this menu in front of us but as you can see it's not something great it's very bland it's not very fancy so if I come over here onto this website, uh, this one right here. So as you can see, this menu is called a mega menu. For those of you who didn't know what it was, this is like this, the drop down menu. This is like a mega menu that has all these things on it. So this is just a reference for this video. I'm just using this for an example so that you guys can understand dealing with over here. So what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and create a mega menu for our website. So let's go back to our store and what we're going to do over here is we're going to go into the apps over here on the left side and over here as you can see we have a bunch of different apps in front of us so what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and install it so over here down below we click on view more apps in this collection and it's going to take us over to the app store with a bunch of different options so what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and find a mega menu for our store so if i come over here i just simply search for mega menu and now it's going to give us a bunch of different options in front of us as you can see over here so we have a bunch of different options so these ones are ads over here at the top and then we have a bunch of different other ones and you can practically pretty much use any one they'll work pretty good but for this video i'm going to use this one over here mega menu by global so i'm going to click over here just simply click on find app it's going to find the application and then we're going to go ahead and install this application on our store so over here as you can see this is the application now we just simply click on install app and it's going to go ahead and install the application on our website just wait a couple of seconds and it's going to take us over to this store where we just simply have two options in front of us either we go with the free version or with the professional which is 9.99 and if we choose the free version and we don't get the number of mega menus and we don't get tabbed and we don't get featured blog post or blog news and multi-language multi-currency remove watermark group items highlight badge or import exports we don't get this but and then that we get all the other ones that are the most important ones i think so if you want to use the professional one you can go ahead and use this or you can go ahead and find another application from the app store that you might find that isn't you know free one so let me just go ahead and do that as well so we're back on the app store we just simply search for mega menu we search for it see other menus as well so we tried the mega menu let's go ahead and try this one as well start mega menu and navigation by quickify same thing we just find the application and install it and see how it looks simply click on install application okay it's signing in as the store over here wait a couple of seconds for it to be logged in and boom there you go so it's installed so as you can see i think that this one is a free version no actually this one also has an upgrade so as you can see over here this is the plans for this website for this menu over here we have the free the basic and the premium and the premium is 7.99 so it is a much less expensive than this one but has more plans as well and it's billed monthly as well so we're gonna stick to the free plan for now and we're gonna go ahead and do it so over here we have a bunch of different options we're gonna create a menu over here or we just go back to the application and click on apps and see what we're dealing with let me just refresh the page over here so over here as you can see we have this option we click on it it's going to take us to the website where we just simply have to create the menu so over here as you can see your menus don't have any items all right we have the profile the tips and the explorer page over here where we can have other uh applications by quickify but for now we're gonna stick to this one and we're gonna go ahead and create a new menu so over here this is how it looks like so this is the simple one we have the mega menus over here and we have the tab menus over here so since we're creating a mega menu we're gonna use the mega menu so we have one two three four five we have a bunch of different templates over here that we can use so you can choose whichever one you want i think that you know this would look pretty nice something like that or something like this it all depends on you we have a bunch of different other ones as well like this one which has products in front of it and their details in the bottom you know it all looks really nice or we can go with this one as well i think this would look pretty good but as you can see it's in a basic plan as you can see collection five it's for the basic one and some are for the premium and some are free so let's go ahead and choose a free version I think this would look pretty nice this is free as well and we have header a uh, list over here best sellers on sales over here pretty nice and this one as well so what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and choose this one actually so we're gonna go ahead and click on it and there we go boom as you can see we have this menu 
and we have this preview for the windows and if we switch to the mobile version this is the preview for it you know it's not much we'll just stick to the windows so over here we can add new menu all right we can add like a home page over here blank single item flow tree just simple and we have menus and then we have tabs over here as well and you can add them as well and you can go ahead and edit these out as well so all you have to do is just simply click on it or just hover your mouse over it you have this option in front of us you have this one option which is like you know if you go to 10 it's gonna you know change the overall you know position of it as you can see the size of it i think and you can go ahead and you know give it a title i just say like popular items over here right click over here as you can see popular items increase the size or like auto we'll just leave it at auto then we have text and icons products over here we have open link and new tab display as heading options you know we can center and line it would look pretty nice all right then we click on the edit icon over here we just do this for all of them over here as well and boom okay we're done then we can add a bunch of different options as well we'll just say categories over here and there we go over here we have categories and then we have the options in front of us the best sellers and stuff like that on sale click on the edit icon as you can see on sale and you know we can even edit this whole section as well as you can see mega sub menu tab menu fly out menu like we can go ahead and do that we can even make like boxed menu in full screen that is for the premium or the basic so we can do that but over here we have product tile number three which is product number three and we'll just call it uh home there we go i think that looks nice and once we have edited out once we have everything looks good we can go ahead and click on save item or save menu there you go mega menu has been saved now we have the app enabled as well and over here we have export data and import data as well and to actually you know apply it over here what we're gonna do is let's go ahead and check out our store real quick but before we do that let me just go ahead and delete this option as well let me just go ahead and delete it there we go so as you can see the mega menu is over here as you can see it looks pretty good home we have all the options in front of us we have categories over here popular items sub item you know takes us over to other stores we can even add other things as well i'll just call it socials over here we can even add another categories over here we can add menu items over here we can even add like a logo over here if we want you know gets bigger and bigger or another row we can go ahead and add that like everything looks pretty perfect pretty fine and really simple like you just edit it over here and it's going to be shown over here into your website over here so it all looks pretty nice over here as you can see categories bestsellers on sales all of that so that's how you basically use it that's how you basically add mega menu over into your shopify store now if you have any questions let me know in the comment sections down below i'll be sure to answer them as soon as possible and if you guys enjoyed this video be sure to hit the like button subscribe to our channel and turn on post notifications and having said that i'll catch you guys in the next video and until then take care and goodbye